Hi guys, Go vs. Dumb again. I'm going to talk today about importing streaming data from other platforms into Stream Elements. It's really simple and it's the best way to get things like your already made alert box, your sub list, your point totals from other bots and platforms into Stream Elements. So we're going to talk today about six different platforms we can import from. It's going to be Streamlabs, Nightbot, Revlo, Deepbot, Streamtip, and GameWisp. So it's really simple. Let's start by going over to the Stream Elements dashboard. And from here, we're going to go over to My Account. Now from here, let's click on Integrations and Imports. And then this is the part of the video where we can actually start importing. Now, if you only need to see parts of this video, you can always go down to the info section down below for the bookmark parts of the video that are most relevant to you. All right, so let's start with Streamlabs. Streamlabs, we can import our alert box and our tips. Let's click on import now, scroll down and click on approve. Then from there, make sure you keep the boxes checked that you'd like to actually have imported. Then click import. And then from there, the imported alert box will show as a new overlay in the overlay manager called Streamlabs imported alert box. And additionally, if you'd like to import any of the tips, those would also show under my tips. Let's go back. Next, we can start with Nightbot. Nightbot, you're allowed to import commands and import timers. Click on import now. And then from here, this will allow us to connect with Nightbot. Click on allow and keep the boxes checked that you'd like to have. So if you'd like to have the custom commands, those will show on the custom commands page on the chat commands. And also those will show under the timers. So just wait a second and those will be imported. Awesome. And like we said, these will show up under custom commands here and additionally under timers if you imported any of those. All right, next let's start with Revlo. Revlo, as we know, is no longer in service. So if you do have your CSV file, you're able to import all your Revlo points. Click on import now, click select files, find your files, which this one is my Revlo points file for me. Click on open, it'll be importing, and then it's super easy to find them after. If you need to see which points were imported, you can just go over to your leaderboard and those will be there for you. So these are all my stream elements points mixed with any Revlo points. Next, let's work with Deepbot. With Deepbot, you can import your points if you have a VIP Deepbot account. So click on import now. And this will require us to have one, Deepbot open and running, and two, we have to go find our API secret. That's super simple. Let's click over to Deepbot, go to our master settings, scroll down, and then find our API secret here. You're gonna to wanna to copy and paste that. Go back over to Stream Elements, paste that in and click on import now. Now, what that will do is it'll also show your points as we did with the other ones under the leaderboard. Next, let's work with importing tips from Stream Tip. Click on import now. It will either sign you in already as it did with me or you'd click on sign in with Twitch click on allow and then make sure that you have the box checked if you actually want your tips to import. Click on import, give it a second and then if you'd like to see your tips just click on my tips and that will show the conglomeration of tips you have from stream elements and from stream tip. Lastly, we can also import from GameWiz. Importing from GameWiz will allow us to see our subscribers list and import our GameWiz emotes for use in things like the chat commands and the chat modules. So let's click on connect now. I'm already logged in, but if not, you'll see a button there where it will say connect with Twitch and you'll just want to press that and it'll take you to this screen. From here, click accept. And then lastly, it'll work a little bit and then it'll be connected. So you'll be able to use all your game with emotes and see your subscribers now. All right, I hope that video was helpful. Please do join us in Discord where you'll be able to get more customized support and talk to other streamers. You can also see some of the other video links here for things like the overlay manager, the pre-flight video, and also chat commands. Have a great stream, guys, and I'll see you around.